Hi everyone, this is Dr. Mike. I'm here at the clinic. Welcome to Health Talk by Doc Mike. And I would receive my vaccine, flu vaccine, this one, today at the clinic. For the viewers out there, please consider to have a shot of this Influenza Tetra, Influvac Tetra, for your protection, okay? And uh, for the viewers out there, Please be aware as well, when you go to the clinic, be sure do not wear this kind of shirt because it's so difficult for the doctors to inject vaccine. Okay, so watch out. private mm, don't look don't <laughs> okay <laughs> my body fat yeah okay, okay. Right. i hope it's not painful okay okay don't worry okay <laughs> i'm afraid of needles actually yeah. all right don't look now ready yeah here it goes ah It's more painful now. It's not okay. Finish. Yeah, finish. <laughs> now you're pressing. I could get faster. <laughs> I think our patient would ask me soon is it painful? <laughs> you can see in my reaction. Ouch! <laughs> okay. So, what would be the side effect of this one? Because some of our patients might be asking. Mainly local, right? Yes, yes. yes. at the injection site. Okay, and then I would be protected yeah. for this yeah. year. Yeah. Okay, so next year I would be receiving another one. That's right. Okay, so for the viewers out there, I could not turn <laughs> because they would see. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, I need to uh, button my shirt first for our viewers. Okay, so you need to consider to have your flu shots. And then this is done every year. Yeah, every, every year. year. Yeah. Usually starting from October. Starting from October. Yeah. And then question because some of our viewers might be asking, why do we need to do this? Because um, new strains of the virus circulate every year. Every year. That's why you need to have the uh, shot every year. Every year. And then how about? Uh, is there a gap that we need to take uh, into consideration if? Patients would be receiving COVID, and then how many days can they? Uh, yeah, that should be uh, an interval of at least fourteen days. Fourteen days. Yes. Fourteen days. Between the two. Days. But you cannot do at the same time. Uh, no, 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 at the same okay. time. Yeah. Or which one should go first? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Okay, just make sure there's an interval of fourteen days. Fourteen days interval, and it should be given what age to what age is there a specific age oh, group? for now for influenza vaccine can be given to anyone older than six months six months six months okay six months so basically everyone is eligible ah okay yeah. so it's safe if for example some of our viewers might be asking that oh i just received a covid vaccine and i have this reaction is it safe to receive flu vaccine? Uh, yes, in the majority of cases. Oh. But in case you, uh, anyone who got some reaction to mm. say to the COVID vaccine, then mm. uh, preferably they should talk to the doctor. Okay, okay. how about for uh, contraindication for flu vaccine? Is there any? Basically, there are no major contraindications yes. unless you are allergic. Mm -hmm. to the ingredients or the components in the flu vaccine mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. or um, you got some kind of uh, neurological diseases mm -hmm. but as you know um, there are two major types of uh, flu vaccine mm -hmm. one is by uh, inhalation mm -hmm. even through the nose now for this one uh, pregnancy is mm -hmm. no good to get the vaccine, vaccine. But otherwise for the, for the injection type 
Mm -hmm. It's alright. It's alright. So if patient is pregnant and if uh, the, uh, the mother is uh, breastfeeding, it's okay to receive this one as the well. The injection time. The injection time. Yeah. Okay. So I think ma'am, for all the viewers out there, uh, you've listened to the explanation of doctor. Don't be afraid. You need to receive your flu shots uh, as soon as possible. Is there any limit for this one? Until when would the government give this for free? Or now, Usually it is recommended to get it before mm -hmm. the uh, flu season, mm -hmm. which usually spans from October mm -hmm. to March, to the March. following year. But, so yeah. preferably you should get the vaccine within this period okay. of time. Okay, and then because some of our viewers here in Hong Kong might be asking, uh, is there a specific deadline? Do we still have the vaccine by next month in November or December? Oh, yes. Uh, okay. uh, no, no, that, no definite deadline. deadline. But, uh, I suppose everyone should come uh, before March, the following year, okay. in order to get the best protection. Okay. All right. Then. Okay. Thank okay. you so much. Bye bye. See you again soon.